exactly. The count to 100 is now down to 13. <laughs> okay. And right back. And killing that swing of an 8 0 run. It's game one. You got to figure out what works. And so I think they haven't really developed uh, the ability to slow down and see what works for them in the half court. Oh my goodness. That's working. Come on. That's Come on now. She was the 2019 Defensive Player of the Year. Second steal of the game for Howard into the hands now of 24 and Black. Agumba Wale. Come on, crossover. Step back. Yes, man. <laughs> Now's the time to try to get multiple stops to keep this thing under single digits or in single digits going into the fourth. Now, Goomba Wale says, yeah, I hear you and all Monica, but let me, just, let me just release the rock and show you what happened. She looked up, saw three, and knew it was all her. Sobbly with it. Agumba Wale trying to match, and there it is. That's what we came for tonight, right? Jewel Lloyd on one end, Agumba Wale on the other. And into the hands of Agumba Wale. Kyla Charles into the game for Seattle for the first time tonight. And Agumba Wale hit one from that exact spot about three minutes ago. There's Horston all the way to the window. A little strong on that layup, though. Coming the other way. It's a track meet up and down the floor. Agumba Wale loves it. She shows the three to everybody. He does it very, does very it well. so well. I mean, how could we not have him read the promos with that kind of execution? Oh, boy. Let's get thick in here. <laughs> Agumba Wale. Oh, Dana Jones, you don't want to make that pass in that scenario. Okupa Wale steps it back. Shimmy, you said she's got one of the best step back moves. And her jump shot, right? Correct. Probably uh, cleaning up on the Burton miss. Here's the pull up. Okupa Wale goes high glass, and you know that it's your night. Tough loss and losing two players to injury. And Great response here this evening. Agumba Wale steps back and hits one more three-pointer before the night is done. Got to go. You know, Patricia Trammell and I were talking, and she goes, Shafu put so much on her shoulder, and then you got Ari. Uh, Crystal Dangerfield as well. It's, that's something that you have to be able to already have mastered as we see a banana. <laughs> wanted Mung to do in that situation. I mean, how quickly do you have to do that? I played overseas for three seasons. Here for the home team. Agumba Wale, four seconds, lets it fly, banks it in, and ties it at 68. Why not make it really hard for Dallas to let her go? Maybe there's a chance. Absolutely. She lives in Dallas full time. Oh, Rike with a three. Easily, it's going to be a long night for the Dallas Wings. You've got to stop her. Eight oh run. Arike stops it with a three. Matter of time. Only a matter of time. Coach Trammell was saying the same thing. Yeah. Like, I think there was an extra step or two. By the way, Shook Sutton's real name, Alicia. Alicia. Outside, oh. that's a three. Now Sutton, this time right side, gets rejected by Kalani. Brown second block. Arike three. Can't guard me is what Enrique likes to say. 17 turnovers in the ball game for Phoenix. They've actually Wait. taken care of the ball better in another three. Enrique is shaking her head like. The leading scorer in Division I this season with Villanova. A star at Lords High School in Poughkeepsie has a Kumpawale, banks it in. About a 17-second difference game in shot clock. Agumba Wale step back three is good. JJ Redick, yeah, partner here on camera right now. So when did Manny Machado do the celebration? Second-year players and assist. Arike with five. Pull back three. Oh. Nothing but the bottom of the net for Arike. Shatu yet to hit a field goal. 0 for four. Here is Enrique, knocks down the three. That's a great thing for Seattle. Dallas Wings offense scored just 61 points in their loss on Wednesday. But there's a Goomba Wale answering with a three. If anybody's listening, Odyssey Sims deserves to be in the W. Daniel Field, cross court pass. Here's a Goomba Wale, dials up a triple. Just try and get some momentum going into the locker room. Agumba Wale trying to shake Lloyd. Difficult three. She drops a triple. It's a shooting display here from College Park Center. They 
really strong shooting afternoon all the way around. We've been treated to some offensive fireworks. Agumbo Wale, step back three. You bet. A fellow Aussie and Lauren Jackson. Just with her ability to stretch the floor. Not saying their games are similar, but her ability to stretch the floor. Sideways, maybe? <laughs> Agumbo Wale launches and gets the hometown bounce. It's a seven-point game here, 10 seconds left to go. It's been a stunning show from Agumbo Wale, and she adds to it. Angles for passes. When she's at the nail contesting shot, it impacts trajectory of shot. A regain. Haley Jones could not stop that. See, you might be one of those people that does a lot of preparation work. Right? Yeah. <laughs> sure. How about the three? It's not something that Danielle Robinson's really done much throughout her career, is shoot that three ball. Right. But about the three. Enrique should have done though, right? And McCowan there for the board. Here's the pitch ahead of Wimbawale. A walking bucket. First shot is a three, a rainbow that dropped from the heavens. Tried to leave it for Cheney, but deflected and stolen it away. Here's Agumbo Wale. He's got that thing on a string. Step back three. Agumbo Wale, good. So Dallas goes back to work with the ball and the lead. Looking to put the brakes on a little two-game slide. Arike. Oh, that rattles home. Nikki Blue says that's okay. Get it back on defense. Screaming from the sideline. Seven minutes to go here in the third quarter. Arike. Oh, come on. Arike. Dallas doing a good job of keeping Washington off the offensive glass. The Doom Bawale! Dallas has played with more patience in their half-court offense so far this half. Enrique! Alicia Clark out on Sabali. Sabali trying to use that height advantage. Bawale! Dangerfield and Candace Parker down on the floor grabbing the right ankle. Wings push instead a three ball and Parker hobbling off the floor, Carolyn. Keep an eye on the free throw attempts. In Wednesday's game, it was all Las Vegas on free throw attempts. They made 20 of 24. Dallas made only 10 of 12. And the three goes down. That's the first thing she talked about when they got back from Vegas. She said this team is still together. And you're hearing <laughs> Ooh, that, that is needed right there in the Dallas. You know, I have a little experience in, uh, but just seeing how she is able to play on their national team uh, has been nothing for the special. She does a great job helping the younger players uh, and really start to develop. Under five minutes to go in the fourth. Goomba Wale guarded by Hole. She will launch and bury a deep three. Hi. I know you are all over the place. I see you at gyms all across America, men's and women's, but what is that looking like for you the rest of the summer? Oh, uh, well, I'm here for a little bit, but I think we'll be back in Connecticut soon at school. Agumba Wale, the three-pointer is good, and Arike Agumba Wale now has 16 points. Not good on the three. Wings with a two-point advantage. Ogumba Wale creates space and knocks it down. And Brown with the board, and here comes Ogumba Wale. JJ's got no shoe. Running around without a shoe. That is a professional, and so is that. An easy bucket. Good offensive rebounding from New York. Ogumba Wale, quick trigger, and that triggers a timeout. Good D there by Vandersloot. Shot clock at 10 as the Goomba Wale breaks down Stewie, puts up the long three, and nails it. With Dallas, they are very difficult to guard. Azure Stevens, no. Everybody is exuding confidence right now. The three goes Goodness! Here is Howard. Shot clock at three. Arike from just west of <laughs> But they're so hard to guard, to guard the wings because they put players in their sweet spots. Oh, sweet spot! 
their fifth straight game. That'll be the third time since they moved to Dallas that they've won five in a row. 2018 Come and 2022. On. Stop it. <laughs> Here is Arike. You saw the double again. This time they let her go single. And Arike drains the three. Bonner does. Sabali the rebound. That's already Satu's fourth. Averages nine rebounds a game. She's sixth in the league. Arike drains the three. Allen already was seven in the ball game. Two better than her average, by the way. Can't stop Arike. Tierra McCowan and Arike. Arike, tough shot, the three. Oh my! What I tell you? What I tell you? Satu also having a career year. Doesn't need a whole lot of space to get her points. Arike launches. Arike drops the three. I'm pushing myself constantly. Couple of players ball got hands on it. We'll give it to Kalani Brown. Here is Arike. Launches. Buries the three. They all know each other. It's an unbelievable community, both the men and the women. And she came back here because she knew she wanted to make a difference. Well, when you need a basket. Arike. Four three. Her fourth of the ball game. In the Seattle win. Agumba Wale got the points, but Jewel Lloyd got the victory. Oh, and Agumba Wale throws it from downtown 5 0, and it's all Arike so far for Dallas. Agumba Wale, second opportunity. She'll fling one up with five on the shot clock and knock it down. She puts up. One of the greats of the league, without question, and glad he could join us here on the broadcast. And we'll see if the Storm can make a run here. They've started to in the last couple minutes, but a Goomba Wally can silence you very, very quickly. That would have cut it to 10. Arike, leg spread three and knock it down. You talked about Sammy kind of splitting her legs. But Marina's their best three-point shooter, and Satu brings great length and activity in preventing those shots. Here is Arike draining the three for 75th of the year. It looks like a man the way they'll pick you up in the backcourt, but it settles into that zone. But move the ball, shift it, find your shooters on the backside. A four-game home stand for the Wings. Arike, they almost triple-teamed her. Arike over Mabry, buries the three, her third of the game. Seven straight field goal attempts. The Wings are just two of their last nine. Arike, second field goal made in the second half. Here comes Arike Ogunbowale, number four in the league in points per game. Watches the three and buries it. 54%. She had a little bit of a rough start to the season, but Arike is finding her rhythm at the three-point right at the three-point line right now. Very physical game. Tierra McCowan has fouled out of that game, kicked it out to Dangerfield. The two from the free throw line extended. Howard on the old glass. Agumbo Wale for three. Knocks it down. Inside out. That's a recipe for a victory. And the lead changes once again on cue. Arike wants to change the score once more. This turned out to be a great timeout by Coach Trammell. Arike for the lead, swirls it in. Eighth lead change of this first half. He lays it home. But if Dallas puts it together in a playoff series, Arike is now four for four from three. They're scary. You don't want to play this team. Really great job at closing off on DB on her three. And she's been able to really attack. Oh, man. <laughs> attack and finish. Eight seconds to shoot. Agumba Wale has drilled five threes in the game. Slings to Kuir with three. Agumba Wale got it off in oh time. Oh my God. Arike Agumba Wale. 
the success of this ball club, especially at home. Okumbole for seventh three of the night. That ties a career high. But solid defense down on the other end by Natasha Cloud walling up Howard and making that shot difficult for her. And then Washington did a good job of rebounding. Agumbawale controls the glass. Here's Sabali. Agumbawale. That one, nothing but net. McBride. I just think she got smacked in the face. It might have affected her vision. Agumbawale. Off the glass for three. And that is career point number 3,000. Three-pointer, oh, that was Notre Dame on Notre Dame. Agumbawale went up and over Kayla McBride. Zavali to Agumbawale, top of the key, and she drains it. Assist number seven for Zavali. Burton will inbound, 22.7 seconds to go in a four-point ball game. She gets it into Agumbawale. The three-pointer is in! Wow! See Kalani Brown running the floor, trying to establish some paint pressure. Enrique with the three, the second three-pointer made by the Wings. For that, everything appears to be all right. She left with about 7.15 to go in this first quarter. Odyssey Sims has checked in for the Wings. Agumba Wale, three is good. Howard, the Hezzy, loses the handle. Jefferson doesn't pick up the foul. Agumbawale off the window for three. Phoenix has led by as many as a dozen and are up 10 now. Agumbawale for three. Great move. She's got 17. The X Factor and the Girl Scouts on Inspiring Girls Day. Annie, 12,163 in the house to watch our recap. Agumbawale off balance, she connects. She hits her first shot, her first scoring. And now it's Dallas with the steal on the inbound. Agumbawale, it's five points in five seconds. Fever are the second best offensive rebounding team in the WNBA. They've got five of them themselves. Agumbawale splashes home a triple. Melissa Smith and Aaliyah Boston both. It's not just high-low. There's so much more than that. They're able to penetrate and kick and find their, their open player. Goomba Wale launches and buries a three. And are way ahead of that blistering pace. Goomba Wale step back on Berger. She drills a triple. I mean, it's, it's exciting to watch. This time, Natasha comes away with it. Third time definitely wasn't the charm no. right there, but it is for Arike finding that three ball. Yeah, you just watch when Dallas makes a basket, there is not even a full second that comes off as we see right here. Melissa Smith got that rebound of Arike's three. Her effectiveness is pretty tough for teams to handle. Well, Satu Sabali did the best she could on Smith, couldn't get it to go. Arike drains the three. She can be a confidence wow. buster. You she can kept play. that so close. Yeah, and we see Arike giving Dallas a chance right here with that quick score. But I think also it's just the game is getting better and better all the time. I think so too. The athletes are getting better and better. Here's Tierra McCowan. Arike over Vandersloot's outstretched hand. She's hitting 36% of her shots from beyond the arc. 19 double-doubles this year for Brianna Stewart, one shy of the New York record. And Enrique again! Slips through the defense, can't get it. Rebound into the hands of McCowan. Here comes Enrique. One on three, a little hesitation. Step back, buries it! Noel Quinn said the person we're worried about on Dallas is Satu Savali. She gives it up! Enrique rattles the three. 54 games since 2016. That's the most in the W. And Enrique rattles home her second. You know, you talk to Veronica Burton. She is such a grounded person. You like to call her a culture person. Yeah, and she, I love the term culture carrier. 
so important for a young player to be able to do that. Agumbawale left alone, dangerous words. Made sure to focus in on that one. She was left wide alone, no one recovered. She had that question post game last yep. game. And <laughs> the players were almost about to answer. She said, wait a minute, that's a question for me, right? <laughs> and I think Tanisha Wright wants to win regardless. They just knocked off six points within about a minute and a half span. There was plenty of time. And because Cheyenne Parker was a big part of that, Arike Agumbawale knocks that one down. And so while that's not a terrible shot, it's a bad shot at the time in the possession. That was the first shot down. The entire team had even recovered down the floor, and this is what happens. Quick shots, 